Let's make this vibration animation on PowerPoint. So first open up your PowerPoint and get a blank slide. Then go to insert, go to shapes and here you have an option free form. I click this and what it will do is wherever you click, for example you click here, then you click here, it creates a path. It creates a path. And then when you end it up over here, it creates a complete shape. And that's what it does. It's very handicraft. Now for the actual tutorial. I'm just going to delete it, then go to insert, go to shapes and pick this freeform and I'm going to make a volume of striking art. Click here, then I'll click over here, then click, another click, click, click. I'm going to make a voltage out of it, so you get the idea, right? Like I'm just going to increase it, increase it, increase it and I'm then going to decrease it a bit, yep, yep, shrink it up a bit, scroll, then down, 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 down. And I guess our voltage is ready and I'm just gonna click over right over again and make this another side. Boom. Done. And then when you're done, you will have this part stretching all over the place. Just press enter and you will have your shape ready. Then go to shape outline and pick this black color and then I'll just go to shape outline again and increase the weight to 3 points and then I'm gonna shrink it a bit. Done. I'm gonna put it in the middle. Then what I'm going to do is go to animations, go in this option and more animation options will pop up. I'll just go to grow and shrink and it will just grow from the, all the sides. We don't want that. We're going to go into some details. I'm going to go to shape animation pen. I'm going to click on this triangle, go to effect options and I'll just click on this auto reverse and go over here, make it 400 and press enter then go there again and click vertical then I'm going to just randomize some options just random some stuff so that it becomes random and go to timing I'm going to repeat it until the end of slide and start with previous and play ok so it's something like this happens alright now what I'm going to do is squeeze it a bit a little more and decrease the duration up to 0 0.01 second then click on slideshow and there you go, our animation is ready. I'm just going to add some two circles over here to make it, you know, a bit smooth. Then I'm going to put it right over there and our vibration animation is ready. Thanks for watching. For more of these videos, don't forget to hit the like button and subscribe to this YouTube channel.